Welcome to the fourth video on how to create an art quilt. First of all, a real cordial thank you for everybody who responded to my question at the end of the last video, choosing a design idea. And what you see on this slide is the design idea that I decided to go with. So it shows many hens, hens of many ages, of many cultures, that show and offer food to the world as an expression of a world without hunger. Once you chose your design, uh, you will need to follow the requirements of that specific design. Some are best expressed with patchwork, others with applique. In my example, I chose painting. I looked at a lot of material and I decided to use a warm background, kind of a beige golden background and to paint on it. So this is the time to consider also if there are any special um, considerations that you have for your technique and how you are quilting. Are you quilting in place, indoors? Do you need the stability of a frame or do you quilt? Does it have to be transportable? So um, I often decide between either a lot of safety pins or frame or something like that. In the end, this is a very fun part of the process. When you set up the real project and you just dive in and get started, knowing full well there will be some iterations. The image shows you that I taped the fabric vertically to a moving panel. I'm beginning to paint with acrylic right onto the fabric and I will show you a few details. I'll start again at the top, here is a detail, and as you see, sometimes I also work at night, so the images change. Looking at the first round, I wasn't so satisfied with the bottom right. I tried a few things until I in the end used some corn. Then I painted the globe in the middle and here you see where it's currently at. Thanks for watching this video and please check in again. Around Christmas 2013 the next one should be ready.